Whatever it takes, I know I can make it through. No, I can make it through. What up, everybody? It's me, Bitchy, here back, giving you another show. Lots of stuff to talk about. Lots of things been going on. Lots of this, lots of that. You see, I got this wrinkle in my forehead. I'm stressed. I'm elevated right now, but I'm still stressed. Shit. (laughs) Thank you, Mary. (laughs) First thing I want to talk about on today's show is Chris Brown. Um, Chris Brown has gotten himself into some more, you know, controversy. But you know what? I'm on Chris Brown's side this time. Because, you know, Chris Brown was tweeting. He was sitting at home tweeting, listening to his new record. You know, maybe in the studio or something. Kicking it with Rihanna, doing him. Not worrying about nobody else. Doing him. And some comedian bitch... Retweeted one of his tweets. He tweeted, he was like, Damn, I look old. I'm only 23. And she was like, Well, a worthless piece of shit like you should look old, or something like that. And then Chris Brown went ham. If somebody retweeted one of my tweets and said, Well, a worthless piece of shit like you should do this, I'm going to tweet the same shit to them. So I'm on Chris Brown's side, and then now he didn't delete his Twitter, so now I can't see none of his Instagram pics, and now I can't tweet him. That white bitch pissed me off. You piece of garbage. You piece of garbage in my New York accent. Leave Chris Brown alone. He beat Rihanna's ass. He went to jail. He recuperated. They're back together. And I don't care. That's them. If more people, you know, stopped and lived their own lives, I think the world would be such a better place. Don't you think so? Don't care. Speaking of Rihanna, I want to talk about this unapologetic album. And I just need to give Rihanna a big old yes. Yes, Re. I love the whole CD, really. My few little favorites, um, Love Song, Her and Future, um, Love Without Tragedy, Diamonds, The Runway one. I just, I fucked with a whole album. And I will be in attendance, Re, March 22nd. And if you want to smoke before the show or after, I will be available to smoke, Re. Retweet, Re. Tweet, Re, right now and say, Re, smoke with bitchy. And record a show. That would be the most sickening show y'all have ever seen in y'all lives. Tweet re right now. Next thing I want to talk about. I need to give a shout out to Adele for this Skyfall song. Yes, ma'am, Adele. And yes, ma'am, for Skyfall. I saw it and it was good. Go see it. Because you might like it. No, you will. Yes, ma'am, Adele for Skyfall. The theme song for the um opening of the movie. Sickening the movie. Yes, ma'am, for the people who did Skyfall 007. I can't wait for the next one. There better be a next one. Okay? Yes, ma'am. Um, the last thing I'm going to talk about on today's show... Oh, no. I need to talk about Halle Berry. Uh, Halle Berry... I'm sorry. What's under my mouth? Halle Berry. I need to talk about Halle Berry because Halle Berry had her new boo be her baby daddy's ass. And I need to give Halle Berry a big old yes. Miss Berry. Miss Berry. Because her boy, her baby daddy was racist, I think. Or he said something about black people and I wanted to try to be around black people or something like that. Some controversy. But I'm glad if he did get his ass beat by the boyfriend, that's sickening. Yes, ma'am, Hallie. You better still be that ghetto chick from Boomerang, okay? Yes, ma'am, Hallie. Last thing I want to talk about today on today's show is relationship advice. Sass talk. Not advice because I need advice my own self. Goddamn shit. So... You know, pretty much I'm single boots. Yeah, I know in the last video I said this and that, but that was this and that. That was then. So, I just feel like the best way to make a relationship work is to just be honest with people. Be upfront. If people text you, text them back. Don't play games, you know. Just just be upfront with people. Just If you like this person, just be with this person. And if people make mistakes, I think you should forgive them. All depends on what mistake it is. If you cheated with your sister or one of your family members, no. But if he just, you know... You know, told a little lie because he was scared. And I think they should be forgiven. But, you know, that's people's opinion. That's people's choice. Whatever. I just want to say, you know, to all those people, I will have my B&J relationship. I will have my no and way relationship. And I will have my whatever relationship work. Shit. Not right now, though. Shit. I'm, I'm just doing me right now. I don't got shit. Fuck it. Next thing I want to talk about on today's show is um, PPMT show December 1st. This Saturday in the Grand Ballroom. Make sure you check that out. Get your tickets now. $5. $7 at the door. Check it out because I know it's going to be sickening. I'm not sure what they have planned. But I feel like it's going to be sickening because every show I go to is usually, you know, a, a good show. So, I can't wait. Um, 
And I also need to announce my birthday bash. All I want for my birthday is a big booty hoe. Birthday bash. Friday, December 7th. Um, here. At the... Just tweet me for the location. I'll put my Twitter um, name down there. And I'll also do a mass text slash mass Facebook thing slash text tweet thing or something like that. It's going down bottles, food, and pre-gaming and then going to the bar probably. It's going to be fun. Make sure you come out if you need to, you know, request off work now. If you're my friends in Bolingbrook and, you know, you want to, you know, maybe surprise me for a, a little, you know, surprise party or something. That would be nice, you know. Request off work now. Get your train tickets now. They'll be 16 to get to Macomb. Come on down. Let's get this, get it cracking. This might be my last birthday, especially if 2012 is happening. I'm not even going to talk about that on today's show because I'm hoping this doesn't happen. Shit. But that's all for today. I will be coming back with more videos, more songs, more music, more everything. So follow me on Twitter. Look at underscore D now 88 and Instagram D nice 1223.